Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. I don't know if I'm supposed to say this. I'm gonna make a video on how to break in your new Doc Martens. I got a new pair. They're the 1460C model. They're all black with... I don't know what it's called in English. I saw them and I just had to buy them. I do have another pair of Doc Martens, so they're my second pair. You may think that I already have a lot of experience with them and I know how to break them in and everything, but that's not true. <laughs> Every pair is different, so here's my tips. I hope they help someone. It's just some things I found on the internet and I hope they work. So let's try them. As you can see, um, I've already tried some. First one is to massage your boots, like just do this, especially on the ankle part because this is like the stiffest and also the top. The leather is still so stiff, it hurts. It's not just hurts walking and then just putting them on already hurts. Push in all directions, you know, like you, when you're walking. I would recommend wearing thick socks because it'll prevent blisters. I would also recommend putting on blister band-aids before you put on your socks and before you even put on the shoes so that when you put on your boot, yeah, it'll just protect your ankles <laughs> a little bit more. It's so important that you don't that you don't wear them to a hike or that you don't go walking in them for longer than 10 minutes the first time because you're gonna regret it. I did a city trip in my last pair uh, the first day I got them. Let me tell you, that vacation was not fun <laughs> and I didn't bring other shoes so don't do that. Then you're gonna put them on. They're going on pretty good, at least this one did. Don't tie up the laces in the beginning, just let them loose so that your feet can adjust to the boot. And I have to tell you, I tried this this morning as well and my feet felt like they were dying, like my shoe was too small, but I bought it in my shoe size. Don't buy a size bigger or smaller just buy your regular shoe size and it'll fit even with thick socks the leather just has to stretch a little so now i'm doing it to the other shoe the other boot my foot feels better in it and it's the second time i'm doing this since i got them the second time i'm wearing them okay this one's harder but it's on and it feels good. So now what you want to do is you are going to walk around in them for around 10 minutes and then you just take a rest because your feet are gonna hurt. If you feel like okay it's going well you can tie the laces but I would not do that because your feet still have to get used to the tightness. That's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna walk around in them for a while. this now twice today and they actually already start to feel better and my feet I would also recommend is to just skip a hole while tying them up not just tie them up to the top so that your feet still can move because the the top is really stiff and it can cut in your ankle, cut in your leg and it hurts. I have some <laughs> scars from my first pair. So don't be stupid like me. Always make sure you wear thick, long socks. Also, give it time. Once you're past that, it will stretch to your feet. 
they will be the best shoes, the best boots you've ever worn and you will be so happy you bought them. You will never take them off again. <laughs> I hope my tips work. Let me know in the comments if you've tried them and if you like my video. Hope you enjoyed watching this. Okay, here's me again. If you would like me doing a lookbook with the new docs, let me know. Uh, also, if you want to see my other pair as well and what they look like a year and a half in, let me know.